It's gonna keep being really loud. Said something before I could even finish typing it out. Monda, y'all. It does support controllers. Let's fucking go. It's fucking loud, though. Yeah, spooky PS1 logo. What do I put this under? Just games and demos, probably? There's a heartbeat sound. All right, this is a, a collection of classic controls. Keep it at 70. This is a collection of demos from Ichio of various horror games with PS1 style graphics for various reasons. Which was requested by Pong. Specifically one game in the demo disc was requested, but it was you could, there was a whole demo disc, so I was like, hey, we could download it. It includes these games, of which I know nothing about any of them. There's the one she requested. Walk. There's also two question marks, apparently. It do be a lot of demos. You can also individually download a demo for each of these. Wow. Play question mark. I'm just gonna hit start, which I assume plays the demos in order. I don't really know. Because if I hit start, it plays something. I don't know what the fuck it is, but... It loads this up. Whatever this is. Them wiggly PS1 textures. The classic wiggle. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, there's like four or five pixels, give or take, on the game. Probably for all of them. That's a loit. Howdy. Uh... Oh, it was a load screen. Okay. <laughs> Hello. I can't tell what you are because you're too few pixels. Ah. You're a skeleton. Welcome, friend. Welcome to the museum, you poor unfortunate soul. Haunted. Oh, this is like an overworld. That floor is trippy. This is like an overworld for the demos, I guess. Please do not pierce my corneas. No smoking in the museum. No dying in the museum. Don't go getting your corpse germs all over everything. Alright, well, fucking... Huh. Alright, bye. See you later, sir. Please wait. I like the little dude in the bottom right. He animates based on what I'm doing. Oh, there's a sprint button. That's a big shitter. Well, you gotta make sure you're capable of containing the maximum, you know, shit possible by a human being. Or a skeleton being, as the case may be. As the case may be. Howdy. There's a computer over here. What's the computer do? Hello? Uh, 
Let me answer password. Help. God damn it. <laughs> I don't know. What's the fucking password? Is the password in here? Oh. It's the credits. Is the password in the credits? Germ food. You're welcome. I know not the password. I know not where to get a password or even what it does. A mystery. Uh, first floor. Why not? I'm on the zeroth floor. Question mark. T mod. All right. Well. That's a horror game? I mean, the rest of these look like horror game artwork. What's going on with this? <laughs> Oversaturated 3D platformer levels. And see what surprises await. Content warning. Sudden loud noises. <laughs> oh, we got everything. We got the whole crew. Content warning. Nothing. Cursed love letter. <laughs> Looks like regular Gmod to me. There's many options. Luckily, there's a motel nearby. I wonder where the one Palm asked for is. Well, it was one of the like last ones in the list, so it's probably at the top. All right, well, this one's in front. What's going on here? Flashing lights. Okay. Are these all in first person? Hmm. Hey. Do I win? Launching game. Oh, switch windows. Oh. Oh, it did actually launch a separate game. Hold on. <laughs> That's not what I was expecting to happen. Does this support a controller? It does. Oh, God, that's loud. What's happening? It's dark and loud. Hold on, I'm gonna... We're just gonna lower, like, the stream volume overall, because it's probably gonna reset the volume every time it opens the game. Yo, this shit's not three. This not first person at all. I am made of like 12 pixels though. This is new. What was the interact button? I forgot. What's that? Ouch. It's cold. Alright. Drain cleaner, yo, we poggin'. Also still kinda loud though. Yeah, that's still kinda loud though. Hmm. 
Negative 18 decibels, Drinkle. I cannot use it. I can examine. My phone. It's old. I don't know where I'm going. That's locked, right? I too like to open doors into my face. These are some taut wires. That's because it's a piano. Forehead. I have to search every drawer. It must be done. None of them have anything. But they could, and you know it to be true. Alright, well. I love how, like, the... Scissors. The actual area doesn't look that bad, but the character is legitimately, like, 12 pixels. Which is kind of impressive. Scissors. Must be left-handed. Well, you don't have to call me out like that. That's rude. Why this room so red, though? Mac Why is this the devil's room? I didn't know they actually made magnets like these. It's true. They do make magnets in a U shape. I don't know why, necessarily. What? Umbrellas? More like yumbrellas. Are you eating umbrellas? I gotta get it. Yes, you do. I agree. Main character. My old friend, the Void. Alright, well. Hello, Void. It's me. That's the bathroom. Bathrooms never go well. Oh my god, it smells like shit. Probably because it's filled with shit. It looks like there's something in it. I'm not going to touch it though. Alright, well that's like fair enough. That door's broken. Who be breaking doors though? Who's breaking all the doors? Also, yes, Mickey. You can tell it's spooky by the way it looks. And also by the sound. Hmm. That's a terrible camera angle. All of these should lead to rooms we've been in. Yeah. We do have a magnet. Would the magnet pick up what's in the bathroom, actually? Hold on. Let's run back. I just realized that. I didn't say it was magnetic, but... In the shit toilet, as it's known. I can't use this. Okay. What if we bleach it? There you go. You just bleached the poop away. The shit's all dissolved. But now that that thing went down the pipe. Now do I magnet it? Whatever's down there moved a little. I can't reach far enough with the magnet myself though. We need something besides the magnet. But from where? 
And for what? Satan's classroom does not have the answers. Alright, well. We checked all the rooms, didn't we? That's locked, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Satan's Clasher. Mm -hmm. I'm missing something from somewhere. But I know not from where. Well, that's a predicament. What if I combine my scissors with a magnet? Oh, okay. What if I combine my magnet with my phone? I don't know. That's not actually how that would work, unless your phone is running a magnet-based storage system, but that's okay, video game. This is a good start to the demos. Streamer already confused. What if I use the sister- the sisters? The scissors on the piano. That just seems unnecessarily rude, but what if we do? Shit, I dropped the scissors. I got a wire. Okay. Uh, combine. Let's test my knot tying skills. Magnet hook. I don't actually know how to tie knots very well, but that's okay. I got a key. A fresh key from the sewage pipe. I'm just gonna leave the magnet here. Yeah, that makes sense. Ah. It is now dark outside. Actually. I don't know where this key goes. Does it go in here? It does. Blue orb! What's that? It has no temperature. Mm-hmm. I hate this camera angle. He's figured it out. It's real fucking dark. Why are we suddenly in the gym on the second floor staircase? That's a good question. Why is it so damn dark? Ah, hello. It did warn flashing lights. I don't know what's happening, though. Ah, hi. What are you? Suddenly music going on? What's happening? What is this? This is not what I was expecting. For several reasons. But also, it's loud as fuck. Hold on. Why is this game so fucking loud? Why am I fighting Satan in like a rave? How do I fight Satan? Oh. 
Okay. <laughs> Satan, what is you doing? Alright. Don't know what the fuck was going on there at the end. The game was building up for the atmospheric horror, and then it did that, and I got real confused. Step into your chamber, let her do the rest. Uh... Who is her? Oh yeah, you can't see because I'm capturing the other game. I forgot how it does that. Hold on. We got it. I got. Let me make a separate capture real quick. Because it's going to switch back and forth. But you like. Down there. There we go. So you can see. What these. Is that the game? Probably. Yeah, it is. We gotta go over here, we gotta change that to this. The software contains scenes with flashing lights. Reduced flashing mode. I like reduced flashing. This game does not support a controller, it seems. It's also loud as fuck, you might be noticing a theme. Malicious code detected. I'm sorry, I download a lot of porn. Tutorial. No, it doesn't support controller. Alright. Welcome to the tutorial. Here you will learn the basics. Wised. You knew it. What, that I'm downloading a lot of porn? I get a- This is why my graphics driver crashes when I open OBS. I got all these viruses. Oh god. This is not a game that would look good on a low bitrate. Oh, that blur. The game's on a low bitrate. <laughs> it's looking real crusty. Which is intentional, I'm sure, but it's looking real crusty. What these? Like a church looking building going on here. Chapel door. How did it say to interact? I forgot. Did it say how to interact? Alt F4. I don't no, that doesn't work. I've been betrayed. I didn't actually hit it. What if we just leave instead? There's another path over here. Maybe we can't interact, I don't know. We'll just go on a cruise in a this sort of direction. Am I supposed to be over here? It's bright over here. Hello? Oh well. That wall texture though. I can't seem to jump. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What the fuck is happening? What's over there? Where am I? Why are we in Tron now? 
Oh. Hello. Chapel door. We're in the chapel now? Do we just not have hands? We can't operate doors? Is that what's going on? <laughs> Hello. I don't know. I do like the glitch error effect going on. Although now I'm back to being confused about where to go. Indie games and their inability to tell me directions. I get up here. I cannot go up here. Ah! Ah! ah we're picking up. Good. <laughs> Streamer figured it out, don't worry. There was literally no audio for that. Hello. I don't know about you, but for a chapel, this looks awfully satanic. Hello. Is this the credits? Who's this? Another lost soul? Arriving here expecting utopia. This reality is not your own. Well, yeah, it's a video game. Turn back. Can I? Can I just leave? It's very loud up there. What's going on up here? Why it loud? That is a shotgun. Again, the, the game's going in a direction that I did not anticipate upon opening it. We now have a gun. All right. <laughs> Hello. Oh, that's a lot of words. Probably shouldn't have shot God in the face, probably. You can help me reclaim this land. Echo stasis can now begin. Can it? I can't tell what the fuck I'm looking at. Hey, forgo your flesh. I like my flesh, though. There's voice acting. Oh. I did it by shooting everything. Is that the whole, <laughs> this the whole demo? It was. These are demos, just so you know, so they're going to be short. Two for two on uh, things that I thought were horror games that turned out to not be horror games. How do I leave? It's bright as fuck in this direction. I'll just walk backwards till it loads. It didn't ever load. Alright, how do I leave then? That looks nice. Unavailable in Demio. You move. Oh wait, this is still yeah. Hold on. I have to actually alt F four. 
Oh god, the sensitivity. <laughs> the sensitivity a little high. Alright. Oh, they get little check marks when you play them. Neat. Still Ridge. Let's say you. Blood. Astral Traveler navigates the dreams and nightmares of the citizens of Still Ridge. Oh shit, we're going to West Virginia. Oh, it opens a page when I hit that. This says it's a point and click. Not a big fan of point and clicks. What these? De Good description. Demo for a game. I'm assuming the description is in Japanese. Oh, this is Walk. Never mind. I know what this is. This is the one Palm wanted. Alright, Palm, you're ready. I think she's around. She may or may not be around. We'll give her one of those. But this is the one that specifically Palm requested. Of which I have seen a brief snippet of. As the as the title says, it's a lot of walking. This like hub world for all the demos is actually kind of cool, but some of the textures are really trippy. Bending machine. That opened the game. <laughs> Very good. Oh, there it is. It's in a very tiny window. Like a very tiny window. Uh, hold on. Transform. Bit to screen. Look at that thick ass mouse. Oh god. Is that supposed to say something? Were there words there? I don't know. Spooky PlayStation logo makes a return. Hey, Terex. This game also seems to be very quiet compared to the others. Maybe that's just the intro is quiet. Walk. But with Japanese words, which also probably says walk. So it just says walk, walk. I can't remember what that actually translates to. Yo, do you support? It does support a controller. Let's go. I don't. Square is apparently except. It has a volume. So I'll just make it full volume because I changed the stream volume. How do you get one of the sightseeing logs on the gate in Gridania? Dude, this is the wrong person to be asking that. Because I have none of them done. <laughs> Let's do this on keyboard. It's me! Walk. I do... I do be walking. There's a run button. I don't know if I should be running. Hello, bird. That's a hideous looking bird, I gotta say. Am I going the right way? Do I need to go this way? Do I need to go the other way? Who knows? I'm in a parking lot now. I see a sparkly though. I also have a crouch button. Which is a great little animation. <laughs> Hide! Am I hiding? I don't know. 
Yo, the controller's not having a good time, though. Neither is this dude's throat. What you doing? What is it doing, actually? Is it leaving? Oh, it is leaving. It's just had, had to do a little chant real quick. Hide, quick, don't be seen. I mean, I can't see myself, so... That's a good noise. I'm just gonna assume it'll leave eventually, or maybe not, I don't know. The controller vibrates a lot when he starts screaming for no reason. Whatever this creature is. Is it is it gone? Are we safe? No, it's still screaming about stuff. As you do. We're just gonna have a little walk into this sort of direction. It's still smoky over there, but I don't know if it was smoky before. A hundred yen! Yo, I'm fucking rich. Uh... Why'd the camera just fucking zoom in and start playing some jams? Where am I? Can't get around the van that way, I guess. Help, I'm stuck on a truck. I think I actually am. Oh, there I am. It just takes me a really long time to walk anywhere. Oh. Back to getting screamed at real quick. The classic screaming of weird Japanese sleep monsters. Bro, I need you to stop doing that. I wonder if I can outrun it, or if it actually moves faster than that at some point. I love how it's made up of like four polygons over there. How do I make the camera unzoom? He's still here. I need to leave, dude. I can see my shadow. Does he see my shadow? I don't know. Tiny shadow over there. Hmm. Yeah, back to screaming, we know. I don't know how they made that noise. Sir, I need to go home and do my homework. Please. Hide, quick. Is it the crow? It looks like it's dropping feathers everywhere. I like this music, though.
It's good music. Alright, we're going this way. Oh, it just zooms on its own. I don't know where the fuck I'm going, or why, so... That fish just fucking fell out of the air. And I can stand on it. Alright. Why is there a fish? Explain. I can kick the fish. 200! I don't know where the... The big bad is. I can only run for so long, I see. Oh. Gotta go quick. He'll never suspect I'm behind this very small structure. See? I think I have to go that way, though. Which seems like a bad idea. Yeah, hey. Wait. I don't know if it still counts. Yeah, you do be screaming though. I thought I was on the other side of that camera area. I'm way in the back. There I am. I need some more yin. Hello? How far is it to this thing? Am I on it? I'm on it now. Where'd he go? Oop. He go here, apparently. Somewhere. This controller is gonna fall off of my leg and it, it just keeps vibrating. Oh, there it is. I do be dropping what look like feathers. I also smoking? Not typical, you know, bird behavior, but... I'm assuming if I can't see myself, it can't see me. It's probably the premise here. Screaming! I wonder when it checks for me being visible. Shut up, bird. I'm trying to make it places. I don't know where the fuck I'm making it, but I can't hide here, so... It's locked. Uh, It's very red now. Where the fuck am I? Oh, there I am. I need a key. From somewhere. I don't know where we're going here. Perhaps over here? Nope.
thought that was the dude showing up. Maybe it is the dude showing up. I don't know. Not going that way. Was this just a dead end for the sake of being a dead end? Go this way. Anything over here? There does not appear to be anything in this area. Like, <laughs> it's like no frames. My head just disappears. Hello! Goodbye. Alright, well, we gotta go back this way, which is where it is, so. Pick up. Oh! Oh! 100 yen. Gotta get back to the vending machine now. With no stamina. Run, little girl. You must be quick. We can rest behind here. It's okay. We're good. We'll just take a chill for a little. You're awake now? Hello, Colonel. Welcome to the Woken Realm of Waking. <laughs> there it is. I do wonder if the music changes. Hello, sir. The house looked pretty good. Pog? What do you mean? Alright, well. I guess I'll just get brutally murdered in the street. I thought I had to be invisible from the camera. Turns out I have to be invisible from the thing, which is a lot harder with a fixed camera. It hears your footsteps. Move quietly. Aw oh, shit, you put in an offer? Let's go. Alright, let's, let's give her one more try here. I know where the coins are now. Walk. I appreciate the aesthetic of this little opening scene. She should probably walk a little faster though, but you know. Did you put in a little undercut on the offer? How am I doing? I'm alright. We're doing a bit of a demo disc here. Oh, fuck. We must hide, as the game saith. What was Crouch? That's the menu, apparently. I remember what the crouch button on controller was. Oh, it's that. Okay. Oh, there's the jam. Such a weird game to have music like that, but... So 
we need to pick up the other coin, which is this way. Am I going to die as soon as I walk over here? Nope, we appear to be fine. Is the palm awake? I believe she's around. Send her aggressive quantities of hearts as is usual. Mop might have fallen asleep, but... It's not that. What do I... What's the damn controls on the thing? It says press to crouch. I'll just do keyboard. Don't yell at Mop to wake up. She needs to be sleeping. Although it is the weekend, I guess. Also, she's been awake pretty late recently. Alright, I'll just fucking die, I guess. <laughs> Fine. That's apparently an awful hiding spot, as it turns out. Although I don't know what I'm supposed to do in that, that uh, alleyway. First hallway is cursed. Look where I died. It hears your footsteps. Move quietly. You move quietly. Game. Betrayed by that hiding spot. Let's see what else we got going on here. If it ever recaptures the thing. Is it broken now? Oh, whoops, I fucked up the captures. Well done, streamer. Here we go. That's one of those games that's probably gonna be a trial and error. I have many ads. Hold on, what's going on here? Ah. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba. Okay. We might come back to that. Possibly. Because we didn't actually get to the end of the demo. <laughs> that hiding spot is garbage, apparently, and I'm not quite sure why. I don't know how I'm supposed to hide from him in that little alleyway. This is weird, oversaturated platformer with loud, sudden noises. I know you guys like loud, sudden noises, so let's see what's going on. As, again, this is a horror... Oh my god. This is a horror-themed demo disc, so... They weren't wrong with the oversaturation. It do be saturated. What the fuck are you? What, are you? what is this creature? Hydrate, that's a good idea. Yeah, it's loud as fuck again. It's a good thing I lowered the volume for you guys. Square is accepted again. Mm -hmm. I kind of like this song. It's a bit of a jam.
much. <laughs> Alright, I, I don't know. Oh, God. This is no menu on controller. It wasn't that loud on the menu. Why is it spinning, by the way? Can I make it stop spinning? Hold on. Maybe the game's bugged? Give me a second. Oops. Typed an E in that. That's not what I meant to do. Or maybe it's just supposed to always spin. That doesn't seem correct, though. No, it's always spinning. Oh. I'll just suicide over there. That's fine. I don't think it's supposed to always spin. I unplug the controller. Stop spinning if I unplug the controller. All right, well... Just touching that kills me. What a cute game. 10 out of 10 cute game. Featuring volumes that alarm me. You can double jump. That is a fat ass bee. Checkpoint. That's also a fat ass star. Whee. I like the toot it makes when it lands for whatever reason. Gotta go fast. No. Can I go back? I can jump back. I gotta get all the stars. I don't know what they do, and it's a demo, so it doesn't matter, but I gotta pick them up. <laughs> Hi, Mop. You falling asleep over there? Or are you not amused by weird... Alright, bye. You not amused by weird duck thing? Fuck suit. Crafting makes you sleepy. It kinda hurts your eyes. It do be oversaturated, as advertised. Crafting makes me fall asleep a lot. That noise is real sharp, too. Crafting makes you happy. I like crafting, it's just it, it does make me extremely sleepy. This shoes squeak. It's shoes squeak. I don't know the gender of this duck. Uh, I don't know about the black holes that are over here. They don't seem normal. Yeah, it's fine. Mouse got out of the window there. Me moose has escaped. That's coding. Public. Public audio source. I can't actually read that. It says public audio source something. That's C. I think. 
That'd be something else. Zoom! I got a C! Streamer's a C rank streamer. Feels bad. That's fine. The saturation is is still extremely high. It's one of those games, yeet. I knew it was going to be. Oh jeez. It's in a demo pack. It's not just gonna be cutesy plat for a horror pack. It's not gonna be cutesy platformer the whole time. Actually, turn to look at me. I wonder if they chase. Do you get closer? You do get closer. Yeah, they chase. What happens if they find me, though? I like the... the music change when it's close. I also like the derpy eyes on the bees. They're very good fat bees. Just in the building now. Stop. No chase. I must go towards you, thus adding to the spook factor. Squeak. Uh. Really can only do these one at a time? I might be able to do better than one at a time, but whatever. Skirt! Hello! How are you? Alright, bye! Squeak! I still gotta see what the fuck- I thought that was fast. Select a character. Oh, it's a little trailer. I was like, wait a minute. It's legitimately just a platformer, but like, it's got random, random stuff happens occasionally, I guess. A dollar? I mean, for a dollar. That's not a bad deal. Hello. Strange creature. Yeah, for a dollar. I don't know how many levels it has, but hell. If you like platformers, there wasn't necessarily anything wrong with that one. It was a little bit slippery. Floaty? Probably I'd go with a floaty definition, but... You could Tokyo Drift around corners, basically. With these. An exploration of life in a doomed country under the wings of a vague menace. What does more info say? Ah, uh, it's a narrative game. We'll pass on that one, too. Forgot the controls for a second. This just looks like a disaster, to be honest. Cursed love letter to Gmod. Poetry-based sandbox slash exploration narrative. What? <laughs> you 
You what? I want more info on this, but there's not really any more info on this. I don't know. What else is on this floor? Something bleeds. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. We'll see what's going on here. It says flashing lights by the by. Just click it. If you got problems with flashing lights... I really do like that little ghost in the bottom, right? Am I the ghost? Probably. Game capture. That one. Bob. Yo, someone named their company Bob before I could make one. This game contains flashing lights and images. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. A lot of horror games with the flashing lights. Controller advised. Well, I hope you pick it up when I plug it in. Otherwise, we gotta reopen this shit. Oh, I think it, it did pick it up. Yo. It even lets you change your controller prompts. We're pogging, we're pogging. I like the reflection in the water, by the way. It even reflects the mouse, or the selection thingy. Spin. Sometimes I remember that I'm going to die. We all are, eventually. Preferably naturally. I don't know what to do with myself. That's a cigarette, bud. And we're also being bullied in the back alley. That's a bit rude. I'm also missing part of my chin. Should we get, look, get that looked at? I have had a cigarette pressed against me. It was extremely uncomfortable. Protagoras bleeds. Protagoras? Protagoras? I don't know. Created by Bryce Butcher. Boucher. There appears to be some sort of syringe that's glowing in that trash over there. Oh, is it tank controls? It's fucking tank controls. We full on PS1 now. What it is with every PS1 in game. Having tank controls. It's a green syringe. Do you want it? Yeah, mystery green liquid. Probably healing, because this looks like a Resident Evil inventory. Can I run? I can. Oh, that's a hell of a run animation. Oh! Excuse me? I need to skip town. We need to stop fucking vomiting blood up, too, while we're at it. Oh, you're awake. We still have a long way to go. I wouldn't blame you for falling asleep again. With my stereo broken, it does get lonely, though. Oh shit, it's animated. Thanks for letting me smoke in here. Don't smoke in the car. He seems unhealthy. How long do we have to go? Quite a while, like I said. Right. Hey, thanks again for doing this. I can't stress how much I needed it. Don't mention it. I know your situation is rough. That house was a constant job. What house? 
why we work in a house as a performance that just wouldn't end. Something like that. Yeah, that makes sense, I think. You want to talk about your AC, my dude? I can relate. Oh yeah, I guess you can. Sorry, my mind is racked. Nothing to apologize about. Do you think we should stop somewhere on the way? Absolutely not. I want to get there as fast as possible. What's the place like, anyway? It's humble. My uncle assured me it'll be just us, though. Two bedrooms, a kitchen, and a bathroom. You live in together? Oh, What about a living room? That too. Is there a house that doesn't have a living room? Well, I guess like the really tiny apartment styles. Is that a promise? Yep. How can you be so sure? I have no other prospects. Well, this has to work out. That's a, that's a mood sometimes. I've been through some shit. I've come to learn. That's, there's more blood coming out of there. Nothing lasts forever. Camera zoom. Yo, vomit blood out of the AC. Also, is anyone gonna, like, mention the blood coming out of the AC, or is that just normal? And the car stopped. Cars bleeding. Cars injured. <laughs> oh no. What is it? The car isn't working. What? I'll have to check the engine. It seems we broke down at the perfect time. A motel. Oh, the engine is bleeding. Like the whole ass car is bleeding. That's That also seems unhealthy. I love this fucking run animation. It's a real good. What's wrong with the engine? It won't open. Oh shit. You think we need to stay here? It's so cold. Why don't you wait here? I'll get us a room. Why wouldn't she just come with me? Just lock the car. And fucking... Presume we have to go this way because the front of the car is this way. Or maybe not. I don't know. Oh wait, there's a light. Bro, it's dark as fuck. Yo, it's dark at night? What's this creepy looking game? I forgot already. Protagoras Bleeds or something like that? Protagoras Bleeds. A snack machine. Thanks, Captain. What would I do without you? Howdy. Don't know why I ran up to the car expecting something to happen, but I did. I just need to go through the snack area. Hold on. I love that. I have like a little chest light. My nameplate lights up. Hello. Hello. What's this? A Greek bust. He has a wing on his brow. Look into its eyes? As if, what? Sure, I don't know. It's the storage system, apparently. This is, this is Resident Evil, alright. It won't open. Mail room. That's literally where I was. Where's the fucking, like, how do I talk to the dude? Hello? Room 109 key. Yeah, sure. Should I go tell her we got a room? It's locked. I don't have eyes. Oh, this facial expression changed when I, when I moved. It doesn't. What this? It's a motel first floor map. Yep, it's it's Resident Evil, all right. <laughs> uh, okay. 
Should I go get her and be like, yo, we got our room? I got a key. That counts as a room, right? Check it. How did I miss the fucking giant check-in sign? Oh, because I went to the other side of this building. She's not here anymore, chat. She's gone. The car eater. Hmm. Alright, I wish it marked me on the map so I could tell where the fuck I was, but... Let's find room 109, I suppose. Which is... where? Reasonable question for which I have no answer. Where even am I in relation to this? What is this? What is... where are the rooms? Where is room 109? Not over here, I tell you that much. It's locked from the other side. Probably not upstairs, because that would be the twos. 105? 104? It was 109, right? Yeah. on this side? Are there rooms on this side? No. Is it inside? Who organized these rooms? Your bulb's broken. No smoking. Who do you think I am? Oh, here we go. 109. It's locked. We'll use the key, stupid. It's now unlocked. Okay, good. Zoe and I decided to spend... Where the fuck was Zoe at? I told her I bought the room. I'll tell her in the morning. There's not gonna be a morning. Oh shit, we're in first person now? Trolls like a fucking whale in first person? That tearing is quite strong. Yeah, sure, I'll take a fucking coat hanger, I guess. Still tank controls, it's just in first person, though. Take a closer look? Sure. Does that look real to you, chat? Can we confirm its authenticity? What a setback. I'm really anxious, but I think I'll sleep just fine. Alright. How do I sleep? Oh, here we go. It looks big enough for the two of us. Head to bed? Yeah, sure. Sleeping with a girl in a motel? Ooh. An empty motel with no one in it, but you know. Then walls don't hide secrets. Well, now we got like a capitalized uwu. Oh well. That's an oh oh no. Zoe, did you hear that? No. Go back to sleep. Are you sure? It sounded like a scream or something. A few doors down. Zoe? Alright. I'm with Zoe. What if we just stay in bed? Heavy sleeper. I'll let her rest. I don't think she's sleeping. I like that it lets you look at the artwork closely. Um, where is this? Just a back door, All right? I don't know if I should be in the hallway or back there. 
Or if I'm going to die, that's a distinct possibility. Can I equip a coat hanger? Nothing happened. All right. Hello? Everyone all right? What's that on the ceiling? Oh, it's a camera. This place has functioning tracking cameras? That's a little suspicious. Ah. Good camera angle. I like that. <laughs> Literal camera angle in that case. It won't open. It won't open. It does show me where I am. So it only marks locked and open doors. Not like the neutral doesn't open, but not locked doors. Reasonable. Don't know what we're doing here. Just, you know. Oh, it's an item. Just a scream from a few doors down, but apart from that, I got no info. Another green syringe. Does it look like something happened over here? Not particularly. Hmm. There's like no audio, really, basically at all. Which is kind of creeping me out, not gonna lie. It's a brochure. We pride ourselves in our unique luxury motel experience. Here at Protagor Prot Protagoras West, we aim to make your stay wonderful and save your money. We hope to help you escape the world outside for as long as you needed. With our impossibly low prices, just sit back, relax, and daydream in our five-star pool. Or enjoy the tranquility of our vast library. Consider one of our luxury rooms if you desire the utmost comfort and enjoy a complimentary breakfast. Thank you for choosing us, and we hope you leave our little paradise invigorated and a changed person. <laughs> changed, you say? Oh, you know what we didn't check, I don't think, was the door all the way at the end. Oh no, we did, it just didn't open. I fucking forgot where we are and what we're doing here. Well, what we're doing is not knowing where I'm going, but... That's about par for the course. It's already so cold outside. Why is there a fan? Maybe they just like air circulation. You ever thought of that, you fucking weirdo? It's locked. I guess that's why the door focuses on that one, because it's a usable one. I do have that coat hanger, though. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. Certainly not a character capable of picking locks. That'd be quite a surprise. It won't open. It won't open. It won't open. Where the fuck am I supposed to be? Nothing upstairs looks particularly confusing.
And the only hint I was given was a couple doors down. None of these rooms are particularly openable. Hey honey, I'm home. Still asleep. Heavy sleeper, all that jazz. Really, we could we could be sleeping too. She has a keyboard? Talk. We'll just leave that on. It's not my water, what do I care, you know? Nothing happened. Alright, well. If I can combine these two into a bigger syringe, nope. Alright. Don't know where I'm going. I was just told a couple door, a couple rooms down there's a scream and I've found nothing. Oh wait, can I open this from this side? Yeah. Quick exit around as you do. This just comes back out here. We've made a return. I don't know. It's got the atmosphere, but I'm incredibly confused about what I'm doing. I cannot interact with that. A fake door. Fake real doors. And this comes back here. Which is just a bunch of rooms that don't open. Pair of pliers. I've acquired pliers. Plier acquire. This does not in any way help me. Because I wouldn't even know where to use the pliers. Just now that I own pliers, I suppose. Hold on, what was over there? Is that still the car? Is it the same car? Hmm. Well, that doesn't seem correct. What could have caused this? I love how he he sees this a bleeding car attached to the sky. And he his only problem is just what could have caused this. Not like, well that's not right. No, it's just eh, that seems weird. Just a you had a bit of trouble with your vehicular there, it seems, my friend. It does continue to be extremely dark though. Not a big fan of the dark. There's my car. Still out here. Doing car-like activities. A red syringe. I've made a blue syringe by combining red and green, which is not how colors work. But alright. Well, of course it won't open. You're not an employee. You a goober? I think it may be time to move on from the video game, because I actually... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I have pliers. I don't know where to use the pliers. 
none of the doors open. I've found an ammo box of 380. No gun with which to fire, said Ammo, but I have found Ammo. I knew it was going to be Resident evil -y. I did say it. These things are so noisy. That door is not even interactable. Yeah, how dare they have air conditioning units on a per room basis? They're so loud. I just keep running this way. What's over here? Nothing but darkness. All right. Well, now I have a straightened hanger. Hmm. What all do you have planned for scary month? Basically nothing. Not much of a scary month plan. Will it let me use it to pick this store? I wanted to do originally? Nope. Hmm. Play IB. Ib Ibanob What is that? We don't need scary games anyway. But without scary games, what's even the point of living? I actually don't know what to do in this game, so we're just gonna move on because I'm confused. Ib is a scary game? Is it IB or LB? I came by me. It's about a young girl named Ib. Oh, I may have seen this actually. Hold on. Vidya search. Someone's going to immediately start speaking. Oh, no, it's muted. Oh, it's Markiplier. Hi, Markiplier. Yeah, I've seen this. Well, I know it I know it exists, but I haven't watched through it. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of them there. Exit. That was kind of a, like, I liked the atmosphere in that game, but the, I didn't know what the fuck was going on, so. Unfortunate. It was a spooky atmosphere, though. You stumbled into someone doing an art of Ib. Uh, I, someone played it, but I don't remember who. Someone I know. What? The hell would... Clinicum once had a reputation of being one of the most reliable medical facilities in Germany. That all changed when that weird loophole appeared. You've played it forever ago? I don't usually play the um, RPG maker style horror games. How you doing? You doing all right? Oh, that was apparently the trigger to launch the game. You know, we'll leave head bob on. That menu for the menu is terrible, but that's all right. No controller support on this one, it seems. What this, Owo? 
The Heilvold Hel loophole. Heilvold. Because W's make a V sound for some reason. Hello? Mm hmm. Howdy. What controls? Left click. Okay. What doing? Can't close doors. What's this? A boxes. Why'd you tell me to fucking interact with it then, game? This seems like the kind of game Mop would like playing right here. First person, ability to close doors behind you. There's certainly no reason you'd have to close doors. Jesus Christ, my dude, what? <laughs> why you just... Why do you sound like that? And why do you stand in there like that? That actually scared me. It's just... <laughs> the scariest thing so far tonight is it's just a man standing in a doorway. One of those situations where the NPC walks slower than you. Lamau got his ass. Where are you going? Hello. I don't don't do that, please. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Hello. The doctor's a little scary. Your office is a little... weird. Don't have a seat? The fucking voices. Excuse me? What it hello? Help? Hello? <laughs> What do you mean? My liver. Why does it get so fucking loud? Can I have my liver back too? Are we back at the start? Yep. Looped back to the start. Alright. That's probably why we can close the doors behind us. Alright. So he wants to take my liver. Hello. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to do besides not be with this guy. Also that he doesn't like if I leave. Where are you going? Do you know I'm here? Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm sorry. Why, why you get so loud? Why you gotta yell at me, my dude? I'm just trying to figure out what I'm doing. Alright. 
He plans on accommodating you in the prison block temporarily. I don't know what's happening, chat, but this man's fucking loud. Streamer's confused. I have an at. Why do I have an at? Oh, is that the art? That is the art. That do be looking like good art, though. Alright. Good game. <laughs> I'm gonna pass on whatever the fuck was going on there, but sure. What was this? Blood. Draw with salt and fight your way through the cursed realm of the endless tree. Draw with salt, you say. Is the game gonna yell at me? Don't yell at me, I'm squishy. All right, is this my salt cube? Salt cube. The shit kind of creepy. I, do, I mean, it is a horror demo. That's kind of the point. Blood, scary events, and evil spirits. Play in the dark with headphones. Well, I have headphones, but I got the light on because I like my eyes sort of functioning support controller it does square is once again the confirm button for reasons unbeknownst to me it's it's the confirm button on all of them x i'm also spinning Controller's fucky. Alright, no controller then. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. I like the visual style on some of the games. This one's kind of nice looking. I don't know why there's an X in the middle of the screen, but... Oh, it changes to a plus if I can do something, okay. Uh, hey, what's up, lads? How y'all doing? Hark, prisoner! Us witches of the salt decree has decided thy penitence. The salt decree. Yes, yes. Thee shalt enter the realm of the endless tree. To reclaim our ancient grimoire inurned deep below its cursed roots. Its cursed roots for this prisoner. Thee shalt be granted freedom. What a tragic fate. Oh wait, they're witches. I can't do that. Yet fear not, the witches are merciful. We're bestowing thee with our most ancient magic, the power of salt. May the salt protect and guide thee to the grimoire. My salt cube. Blessed cube. I'll draw two lines. Okay. Mm -hmm. So R to reload my salt. Okay. I don't know why I need to draw salt, but I can draw in the video game. I was tempted to draw a dingle dongle, be honest with you. Get in the church before the bell rings four times. Keep the beasts in your sight. Hmm.
Are you a beast? Uh... Yep, you move when I don't look at you. But I can't just look at you the whole time. Hmm. The trees have eyes. I want to see some. Can you cross that? It appears incapable of crossing that. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's basically peanut and tree form. It's fucking dark. Alright, here's what we do. Do that. Remove the old one. That was the second bell, I think. Hello? Holy shit! Fucking Christ almighty, where did you come from? <laughs> you stay there. Do you live there now? You appear to live there now. All right. Christ. Um. I'm out of salt, though. Hello, sir. Well, I don't, uh, <laughs> I was going to say, I don't like that anymore. All right. Good. Great. Howdy. How you doing there, lad? That's too thick. Might be right. There's another one here somewhere. There he is. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, should I? Probably not.
Yeah, we might have regretted that. Oh, Jesus, Lord. <laughs> oh. 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 You stay there. As soon as I hit that button, I, f I knew that was a mistake. Howdy. Try gyrating your little booty there. So the, the problem here... Is that's not the one I was afraid Ooh, I'm fucking dead. <laughs> Shit. Hmm. How did you get out of there? Well. Time to die, chat. Why can't I throw salt on you? Is that an option? All right, well. There he is. Nope. Let me in. I'm in, bitch. <laughs> Aha! Ble blessed be the power of doors. This, this game has scared me and I dislike it. I have been startled. You've made it. This tunnel will lead you to the realm of the endless tree. And we weren't even in the realm yet. Getting the grimoire will not be easy. Grimoire. You carry the curse of this place with you. I'm gonna scream like a little girl. Probably not. I may end up punching the mic, but you know. You must find a cure. It has already started to... Ah, uh, shit. Is this why the church was closed? What terrible secrets lie below? Make sure to clip it. You can't use that against me, Mop. You shall soon find out. May the salt protect you. You're more of a scaredy cat than I am, Mop. You telling me you wouldn't scream if you turned around and there was a tree trying to kill you? That was a very short demo. I liked, excuse me, I liked the concept. You'd punch everything in the face. I liked the concept of that one. It scared the shit out of me because they don't make noise when they move. So you go from being, I actually bit my tongue on one of them. Oops. I can legitimately bit my tongue because it spook it startled me out of nowhere. It's when I was following that blood trail the first time. I looked to the right for like half a second and then back to the left and there was a tree about a half a foot from me. You wouldn't think trees were that spooky, but apparently they are. 
How do I go back in the elevator? Oh, the elevator had to get to me. I see. I want to see Mop play a scary game. The drowning machine. That's actually... This is an actual thing, by the way. There are... There are rivers in the United States where if you are in the water, they will not save you. The Coast Guard will not come to get you out of the water. Just so you know. Oh, that's just going to make me sad. Let's not play that one. Yeah, where is the New World stream? It's Halloween and that means candy. That just looks like a shooter. What is this? You don't know how to stream? Uh... You open the streaming program and you click start, start streaming. I will see what's going on here. Probably the last one though, and then I'll stop. If you actually want to know, is it really that easy? Yeah, more or less. I mean, there's like a couple steps, but if you actually want to stream something, I can help you. If you want to stream to Twitch, you will need to connect OBS to Twitch. There's just a button to log in, basically. And then you click the plus, you add game capture, you pick the game, and then you click start streaming. That's more or less it. If you want to, like, have microphone and game audio, there's some audio balancing to do, but... Sounds like too many steps. This is coming from the person that will literally sit there all day and grind something. Not available in demo. Arcade mode? Yeah, sure, I guess. Don't know what arcade mode is, but sure. Classified. Mission briefing. Once again, step into the world of survival horror. While playing in arcade mode, the placement of items, enemy encounters, and the level itself are randomly arranged. Your goal is to retrieve the vaccine from the storage room. Return to the cargo. The final rank will be determined by your kills, damage taken, items gathered, and completion time. Good luck. Okay. It's a nice looking game for the graphics. For the... Graphical fidelity they were going for. Like, if you had something like this running on a PS1, which is the look they're going for, that'd be pretty pog. So these are the Delta Labs. I've got a bad feeling. Mm-hmm. That door is possessed. See, I told you. It's going well in there, it looks like. I need to hurry and find that vaccine. Loading. It's over the shoulder. This barrel can hands might make for good fireworks. This game's a little floaty. Good heartbeat. So there's a key card down there, which I don't know, I'm going to assume I require for the vaccine. Much of a map, but... Welcome to the Delta Core Laboratories. Please read the following instructions. You can run faster by holding shift, interact with E. 
Evasive roll with space, crouch with C. <laughs> Follow the built-in area map in order to track your current location. Main pathways have been marked in blue. Oh, it's got the Resident Evil door animation. Not the Resident Evil enemy style, but you know. FF tends to crash if I try to play plus watch Twitch. Not sure how comp will handle streaming. Probably not very well, to be honest with you. The sensitivity, by the way, is like infinitely too high. That's just a dead end. Why would I want to go that way? But this sensitivity is like 50 times higher than it should be. More ammo, poggies. I wonder if the enemies respawn. Not particularly spooky so far. But that's all right. Oh, hello. Come along, friend. How much ammo do I have? Quite a lot! Oh. Are there more of you? Hello? Eternal's locked, won't be able to use it. M4 carbine. I would change guns. Like that, apparently. Okay. Is that a fucking shotgun, too? Poggies? suppose you are supposed to, like, speed run this, considering they give you a score on a timer. What's in here? Enemies, probably. There do be a fire over there. And a very loud reload animation. Mm -hmm. There's another little dude. I don't understand what those are, but the little dudes. Shotgun ammo. Alright, we need to go this way for the thing, right? Yeah. What are the door colors? Are like a difficulty of the room or something? That's the only way? Yeah, that's a dead end. And I'm running out of rifle bullets. Well, I don't have time to play video games. Why not? You always have time for video games. Oh. 
wonder how many of those there are. What if there's one in every room, though? Why you make the spooky sound effect? There ain't anything in this room. Why you being spooky about it? Taint no need. Keycard. It's just a lot of guns around. Computer terminals locked. Okay. Now does stuff respawn? Yep. Oh, there's a big boy over there. I see. New friends when you get the vaccine. Yo, tactical roll. That was the first hit I took, but also tactical roll. Hey, big boy. Hey, big boy. You're a little slow, ain't you, boy? I should use the shotgun. At least have shot the thing at some point. Probably a bit overkill to be using that for that particular purpose. You know, what if I just don't and say I did? <laughs> hey, tactical roll. I frames during the whole ass animation, which makes that really easy to time. Ah, oh, fuck. Except for when I get stuck in a corner, and then it's less easy to time. What do you mean there's a fat man in here? What do you mean I blew myself up? Alright, well... <laughs> Good ending! 10 out of 10. Recommend. All those other barrels I exploded. And it was the one in the final room that took me down. Alright, well. We're gonna stop here for tonight. Though I may come back to the demos, it's possible. We do have the rest of this floor and a whole third floor, so. We may return to these, but for now I'm going to stop. You can't go back to the ground floor. Alright, well, good to know. So thanks for hanging out, watching, keeping company, all that jazz. Appreciate y'all. Uh... And I'll see you next time, I suppose. Or Mop will just stream before she goes to bed. Easy. So, thanks for watching, I'll see you.